How long have you guys been doing CrossFit? Since uh, July of last year. No, the year before. Yeah, so almost, uh, I think I'm probably at 20 months and you're at 18. Maybe? Started a month after Yeah. COVID. Why did you start CrossFit or how did you find it? You know, the thing was is we were trying to find something to, to do. Yeah. You know, we were both uh, former college athletes and had just kind of bounced around from like a boot camp or a, a <laughs> booted P90X. We did yeah. Insanity before a wedding. I was a group was class awful. junkie before yeah. and constantly going to like every type of group class I could find. I needed someone to like push me and make me work harder and mm -hmm. I liked competing against people. So funny story, right before we found CrossFit, I made him do a boot camp with me called Nice Butts. What is it? No Guts, no nice, guts butts. nice Butts. <laughs> in so. Forest Park and he hated it and he was super embarrassed we were out there doing it one day and like everyone, his co-workers drove past and were like yelling at him, <laughs> making fun of him. <laughs> so Andy decided nice. we needed something different to do, but this was kind of perfect. What else did you say you tried? We did Insanity. Uh, it's, okay, the two uh, big ones. Yeah. <laughs> um, so what are your, what did you like about those programs and what, you know, how does that compare to CrossFit well, like, I mean, for those, people that are they, on the fence? You, you work hard. I mean, they definitely, they, they get your heart rate up, but um, I think, you know, having to do it by yourself in your basement or your garage or wherever it is that, that you're doing it, um, you kind of can give yourself an excuse to, to lighten up or say, oh, I only had time for 30 minutes of it today. Yeah. Um, and it just, I didn't enjoy it. I didn't have any fun. Yeah, I think that's the biggest difference is it was like something that you had to do and it was just like, oh man, I got to go do that today. And like we're excited to come to the gym every day to see yeah. people that we like and it's a fun atmosphere and to compete against ourselves and each other and it's just completely different in that. Did you guys do those those things together before you came here or did you just kind of both did them? Not mm -hmm. really. We, we would have, separately. Yeah, we would occasionally try them together, but... Yeah, just lost so, so CrossFit brought you guys closer together. <laughs> yeah, yeah, in a weird <laughs> it's way. Good. Yeah, I mean, it's something that we do together every day. We didn't have something like that before. I mean, we hadn't been married yeah. long before we started doing this, and it's fun to have an activity that we can talk about and yeah. share together. It's yeah. been awesome. You haven't, uh, have you done any competitions, like anything competition wise? Yeah, I got across sick it? last year right before Max Effort and Mardi Gras. Okay. I haven't done anything. That's, so you have, so kind of yeah. along those same lines, like you've had a little bit of taste of what competition was. Granted, it's in the same gym with, with roughly the same people, um, but how does that, does that change your perspective on the, the team sport aspect of CrossFit? Um, no, I mean, I thought the competition was awesome. It was like super adrenaline rush. I mean, that's the first time I ever got a pull up what's in competition because I feel like you just try and push, I mean, it's uh -huh. just a totally different atmosphere, and I did things that I didn't know I could do because I was in a competition mode. Um, yeah. So I think that's pretty amazing, but um, I guess we, we've been to, we went to the competition that you guys all did, a couple of those, and they're really fun to watch, too, just to watch. Yeah. Is there anything that you, like, weren't doing before and never, never saw yourself doing in in the realm of fitness that you got in here, and what, what has that been like? Like everything that we, pull-ups, <laughs> couldn't do any of those, like can actually do pull-ups now, double-unders, like almost every movement I couldn't do before, and I never thought I would get there, I don't know how many times yeah. I said I'll never be able to do one. And Coming in with a, an athletic background, you know, I, I think it might lend itself to, to a couple of things that we do here, but, you know. Yeah, because you're probably no stranger to a weight room. Yeah, I'm no stranger football. to a weight room, but, but, you know, I'd never been in a row machine before. Yeah. I hadn't done double unders or jump ropes since high school. I've never gotten up on a pair of rings. Um, so there are a lot of things that really um, kind of level it out and put you at ground zero. And uh, it's really fun to be challenged in a, in a unique way like that, especially every, you know, every day we can come in and do something that, yeah, occasionally we do things that I've, I've done before and I'm good at, but most of the time I come in and I've got to learn, which yeah. is fun. Cool. Well, Andy, Sarah, thank you very much. Thanks.